Well, it's April 8th, 2011. I'm at the house that belongs to a good friend of mine. I called him this morning and said they got him for copper wiring again. He just had it put in three weeks ago. <clears throat> Don't know how much he paid, but uh, nice brand new wiring. And it's tough out here. We got a nice respectable homeowner over here, you can see. But look what we got next door. You know, pieces of crap, all boarded up. You can tell by the faded boards, it's been boarded up for a long time. It's uh, missing siding. Probably all kinds of stuff inside is never going to be brought back to habitable condition. We got a boarded up house next door. Nothing very much. And the street down the way is in all that good a condition. You can see he's doing his best trying to keep things up. <clears throat> Looks like new paint, some new doors. But you got this next door that you got to deal with, you know? Siding missing, probably doors, windows missing, windows. You try and secure the house the best you can. But what do you do? <clears throat> the tenants are tough. Uh, the judge is tough. The economy is tough. Scrap thieves are tough. You know, the carpets are as clean as you would expect in a rental house in Flint. He's got a for rent sign there, must have been in the window. You want to be able to advertise your houses for rent somehow to let people know they're for rent. Otherwise, how do you rent it? Except maybe by word of mouth. It's a nice viable house. I guess it's worth putting the wiring back in. Carpet's clean, walls painted, light fixtures. Kitchen floor is respectable. It's got a kitchen sink. Paperwork for uh, applications to be filled out. <clears throat> and uh, here's where they were in the basement. I don't know how much we're gonna be able to see on video. Uh, that must be the window that was broken. That window there that's boarded up. The other windows are boarded up so it's really dark in here. You don't want people to break in so you got boards on windows. Unfortunately there's not too much you can see down here but uh, you wouldn't see any wiring here for sure if there were lights around. So that's what we do. Put the houses back together, try and get them rented out before somebody breaks in and takes the wiring. Too bad they don't have plastic wiring you can replace the copper wiring with, you know. Luckily we've got plastic plumbing we can use and at least they don't take that anymore. So we'll just keep banging away. Just keep doing what we can do. We need some help over here. We need to get some control. we got to be putting people in jail that commit felonies over here in the city of Flint.